Tuesday, and it's time for Family Feud. Okay, thank you so much. I'm your man, Lucky McCoy. We've got two families ready to feud it out for a load of cash. These folks are looking lean and mean. I can tell they're going to put up a good fight to win today's jackpot. And they'll be playing against our toughest team of champions. Here's how it works. You and your family will guess the answers on the board to our survey questions. Whichever team gets the highest score goes on to play fast money for the chance to win 20,000 big ones. It's feuding time. Let's do this. We're going to start with the face-off. Who's playing? Let me see you up front. We're on the hunt for six answers. When you have an answer to our survey, buzz in as fast as you can. Whoever finds the top answer first gets to decide if they want to play or pass. 100 people, we ask them the following. Give me a word that rhymes with the word prank. You buzzed in first. It's worth a shot. Let's see it. Crank. You found the number one answer. So what's the deal? You gonna play or pass? You gotta play after a great answer like that. Think you've got a good answer? Let's hear it. That's good. Our survey says, rank. We're in the points. Oh, nice. What do you think? Nice. That's what you think, huh? Survey says, tank. Correct answer. Ooh. Give me a word that rhymes with the word Maybe. prank. Yeah. Nice. Did our survey say it? Bank. You failed to find an answer, which means you get your first strike of the round. No. Give me an answer. Uh-huh. That's a good answer. Are you sure about that? Is that one of the ones we've got left? Blank. Another strike. Oh no. Your guess, buddy. Uh -huh. That's a good answer. Feeling lucky? Our survey said. Dang! Way to stay in the game! Oh, yeah. Nice! Give me a word that rhymes with the word hum. prank. Good. All right, let's try it. Is it up there? Sank! 
Dang, that's three strikes. Sorry, folks. Nice. Ho -ho. Ah. Like my friend Al Capone used to say, our other family has a chance to steal. All they've got to do is find one answer on the board, and they can steal the round. Give me an answer, and if you're right, you get all the points. Give me a wrong one, and, uh, well, you know. Got it. Survey said... Plank. That's not the one. And we got ourselves a winner. We've got some answers to go through. This is the fourth answer. Shrank. Number two, time to show yourself. Frank. Which family is leading the way? Let's find out. The first points of the game are on the scoreboard. Let's get things going with a face-off. I'm going to need one person from both families to join me up here. We've got a full board of eight answers this time. Get those buzzer fingers ready. We got 100 people to answer the following question. Tell me something a lot of people have that they can't afford. You're in first. That's a good answer. Said with confidence. Show me the answer. House. Well, you hit the target, but it's not a bullseye. The number one answer is still up there. Tell me something a lot of people have that they can't afford. Sure thing. Is it there? Car. It's the number one answer. The decision is yours. Will you play or pass? Great, you're going to play. You're up. What you got for me? Okay, then. Is that answer good enough? Credit cards. You yeah. got it. Ah. It's your go. What do you think? I see where you're going with this. Do we have it? Bed. Uh-oh, it's not there. And that means you've got yourself a strike. Tell me something a lot of people have that they can't afford. We have an answer. Let's see if it's there. Boat. You've got another strike on the board. It's up to you now. All right. I want to see that answer. TV. We're still clinging to this game. Yay. I bet you've got a great answer for us. Huh? That's, a great answer. That's your answer. What did our survey say? Tools. Three strikes. We could be about to witness a steal. It takes just one answer to steal and take home the points. Tell me something a lot of people have that they can't afford.
Okie dokie. Let's see if the board's got it. Jewelry. You know the score. It's a win over here. Let's see those missing answers. What's behind number seven? Clothing. What came in sixth place? Bills. And number four, please. Phone. What are those scores doing? One family's in the lead. The other, well, let's just say they're biding their time for the moment. Who's what Who this sucks? Are you ready for a face-off? Who wants to play? Get over here. The top six answers to this question are up on the board. Whoa, things are getting hot in here because the points in this round are doubled. We took a survey, 100 people, Name something a cowboy might say he wants to be buried with. You're up! Good. Yeah. Answer accepted. Let's run with it. Horse. We've got a right answer, but it's not at the top. Have you got some feud for thought? Name something a cowboy might say he wants to be buried with. Oh, okay. Do we have a right answer? Cowgirl. Oh, so sorry. It's not there. What's it going to be? Play or pass? Rejoin your family and let's get started. I'm going to need a guess from you. Interesting answer. Show me that answer. Hat. Bingo. All good answer. Got an answer for me? Yeah. Nice. Okay, sure. Is it up there? Show me. Gun. Excellent job. Oh, yeah. Name something a cowboy might say he wants to be buried with. All righty then. And what did our survey say? Gold. That's your first strike. Two more and you're done. All right, you're up. Oh. Okay. Is it up there? Let's hope so. Boots. That's the big money maker. Oh, yeah. Two answers remain. Yeah. Good. Okay. Let's see if that's a correct answer. Saddle. We're nearly there. Nice. That's a good answer.
Name something a cowboy might say he wants oh. to be buried with. Here we go, then. And is that the answer we need? That's another strike. Oh. Ouch. You're still alive. What do you think? Yes. Could it be up there? Let's find out. Ooh, that's your third strike, folks. Oh, our other family has a chance to steal. If this family finds just one answer, they'll steal the round. You've got a shot here. Ah, yes. Our survey says... Denim. They couldn't do it. You're so far ahead that I can barely see you guys. Just the one answer left over. Number five. What are you? Spurs. Let's take a final look at those scores. And we have ourselves some winnerinos. Now you're going to play fast money. Oh, our dream team of champions has been defeated. Buckle up for some big bucks. It's time to play Fast Money. You're up first. You'll get five questions, and you'll give me the most popular answers for them in order to score the biggest amount of points. If you and your buddy can get 200 points or more, you'll take home the big bucks. Your time starts now. Name a place you go where everyone is lying down. Name something little kids stick down the toilet that clogs it. Other than turkey, name something else that people stuff on Thanksgiving. Name something you'd expect to see at the Harry Potter theme park. Name a sea creature you wouldn't want to be compared to. We're done. Now for the second contestant. Think you can do better? It's your turn to answer the same questions. You need to be careful not to duplicate any answers. If you do, I'll ask you for something else. And here we go. Name a place you go where everyone is lying down. Name something little kids stick down the toilet that clogs it. Other than turkey, name something else that people stuff on Thanksgiving. Name something you'd expect to see at the Harry Potter theme park.
Name a sea creature you wouldn't want to be compared to. Other than turkey, name something else that people stuff on Thanksgiving. Name a sea creature you wouldn't want to be compared to. Ooh, time's up. And now you can relax. That was the final question. Let's bring both of our players out here and see how they did. First up, we asked, name a place you go where everyone is lying down. The answers to this one, you ought to be happy with those answers. Oh. Not bad, that's some solid answers there. So the top answer, beach. The next question, name something little kids stick down the toilet that clogs it. So here's what you said. I think we might be good on this one. Oh, Number wow. one answer. For this question, we asked, other than turkey, name something else that people stuff on Thanksgiving. This is how you answered. Those answers look good, don't they? Take a deep breath. You just need a few more points. Next up, we asked, name something you'd expect to see at the Harry Potter theme park. You said, you should feel confident with these answers. Whoa. Yeah, that's how you do it. How do you like that? We've got ourselves a big winner. Just briefly, let's see what the remaining answers were. You've just picked up 20,000 big ones. Way to go. We'll see you next time. Until then, love your family. Don't feud. Good night. Do you want to play again?